You guys, welcome back to Cheat Day. Grab your chopsticks, because we're <laughs> heading to Japan. Well, I mean, Japan's coming to us. Whatever, details. Sushi! So, Sinead, first things first. This is our maiden voyage together on this show. That's not true. It's not? What do we eat together? Um, well, I'm really sad that I have to remind you of this. What but, was it? Uh, pancakes. <laughs> That's right, pancakes. Yeah, remember? Uh, Everyone hated me on that episode. That was stupid. You're gonna love her in this episode. <laughs> oh my gosh, what is this? Wow, it's so pretty. Organized, hello. <laughs> we have full descriptions of everything. Okay, so I gotta let you guys know, Sugarfish is like the spot in LA. I know everybody talks about Katsuya and Nobu, but if you want like legit sushi, you gotta go to Sugarfish. Do you like wasabi? No. Okay, well, I'll take all of that. I've eaten it whole before on this what? show. <gasps> Doesn't it burn Poop? the inside of your nose? Oh my gosh, Jaws, how I'm do you sure. do that? Maybe you've changed your mind. No, 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 Maybe I know. Maybe your palate has no. changed. Maybe a little dab, a dollop of daisy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that. Just stick it in there, just stick it in. So we have some soy sauce and ponzu, lemon. Ginger is my jam. Ginger and pour that in. Pour it all in. Put with ponzu, albacore and albacore belly. Oh, so you have to use different things for different sushi. I have never been aware of any of this. Can we just like not? Is that yeah, okay with what do you want to start with? That this looks, looks like, tuna, like spicy right? tuna. Right. We're gonna dip it, gonna dip it in this. Do you want to put tuna on your tuna? Oh my gosh, tuna on tuna, inception. One, two, three. Cheers. Literally amazing. See, there's certain fish that I don't mind the texture of. Tuna is one of those fish because it's thicker, I think. Mm -hmm. I have had some sushi that like it slides down my throat and I'm like, I'm not okay with this. No, and also we have to point out too that you're really, really good with chopsticks. Me? Yeah. I had to practice. When me I moved too. to California, it was so bad that I went to a restaurant and they had to give me a helper. Oh my gosh. The One of those waiters noticed how awful I was. Are you serious? Yeah, because I was literally doing it like this. I was like, Okay, what's that? Um, I don't know, some sort of fish. It's either yellow is that tall, Engawa? or engawa, or snapper, or halibut. This is a scallop. How do you know that? I saw the picture. But they all look the same. But I feel like this is telling me it's a scallop. Oh, and I think it's supposed to put a scallion on top I for garnish. I think I'm supposed to have ponzu in this one, because... Look at that. I like that. Mmm. I would never go to sushi on a first date. Can you imagine being like... No, but opposite, opposite day. I always tell people, oh, go to sushi so on a first date. Why? First off, if sushi is like important to you, the other person needs to like sushi, number one. Mm -hmm. And if they don't like sushi, they gotta be down to get some teriyaki chicken because life's about compromise. You wanna look at this on a first date, like, mmm. Mmm. But I also love, it's like, ooh, what do you like? You wanna share? Let's get a bunch of stuff and share. Ooh, you like rainbow? Oh, I like rainbow roll too, you know? Oh yeah, no, you know what? No, yeah. If you go to sushi on a first date, you can't speak for most of it. So Which is also good sometimes. <laughs> that's true. Also Maybe edamame. Oh, I love edamame. I walked into my parents' room the other day. I'm like, mom, I start talking to her and she's like, Making this face, I'm like, what are you doing? I walk closer to her, I realize she's eating edamame. In she's her room? She's trying to eat the entire thing. So she's like, oh. like, I'll look like this. She's a bowl of this. And she goes, I just like joked. Thank she, God the fish is slippery. She goes, this is not good. How did you show your mom how to eat this stuff? So I like to dip it in sauce. Okay. Right? Dip, dip. Put the whole thing in my mouth and I use my teeth. Or you can use your two fingers, your two top fingers there to pop it out. Oh no, I lost a bane. And here we have the rainbow roll. Oh, Sinead! Our faves. So rainbow roll is our favorite. We just bonded over it. It's really colorful, I think. I will be honest with you. What? I always gravitate towards the tuna and the salmon, mostly because all whitefish sushi uh -huh. is really fishy to me. Okay, well, I feel like that's why we go together so well, because I gravitate more towards this. Are you serious? This is working so well. Because I'm always like, the salmon freaks me out a little. What? It's See, like, I know salmon. Salmon and I are friends. I get it. It gets me. This stuff, I'm like, I don't know what color you are. Like, is that a brown or is that cream? No one knows. But it's provocative. It gets Whoa. the people going. Oh, is so that that's, eggs? that's salmon roe. Eggs. Baby salmon. So, like, think about all the fish this could be, but you not. You guys, remember the first scene of Nemo? We'll name uh, this half Marlon Jr. and then this half 
Coral Jr. Don't I was talk just, about it, Sinead! was just gonna say Finding Dory rocked my world last year. I've never seen Finding Nemo. Really? These little orange things? Don't talk about it! What happens? They all get no. eaten by the shark? Yes. It's okay, Daddy's here. Are you Not sure you bastard. haven't seen it? <laughs> no, I just had to take a wild guess. Because <laughs> that's literally what happens. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh man. The other thing about sushi is, whoa, I just swallowed it whole. <laughs> whoa. Totally. Let me just give you guys a bit of advice. If you do go on a first date and you're eating sushi, and you're like, I'm a girl, I don't wanna take a big bite. If you don't eat the whole thing in a whole bite, you are going to hate yourself. Let me show you. Okay. Sinead, let's both yeah. do this. I'm just gonna take a little bite. <laughs> and Are, then you're trying to pick it up, you're like, and you're like, Oh no, it's falling off. Oh like, oh. no. Oh, I'm just a cute girl. I swear I'm cute. And then you want the guy and you're like, to see you put this into your mouth. Like, like this? No. Bring on the next one. Hand rolled baked crab. What? Okay, so I'm gonna be real honest with you. Okay. I'm not a huge fan of baked sushi rolls. I just feel like sushi is so much better when it's raw and cold. I totally agree with you. Warm sushi, it's really weird. It's, and it's like, like going cookbook. against the natural law of things, you know? Right. It's like I feel like that's not how nature wanted it to exactly. be. Exactly. This is not the way sushi was intended. God this did is not what happened it when to be like this. sushi came to America. Everything about this is not very sushi like, you know? But can you guys see that? It's got avocado inside, which is my fave. This is good though. This tastes like nothing to me. I don't know, I'm really into the paper. I kind of like it because I feel like it's light, but I kind of don't like it because I feel like it tastes like nothing. Did you know that some of the crab is fake? Oh it's yeah. It's like synthetic? Most of it is. Most crab nowadays is fake crab. So like how do they make it? What is it made out of? I have no idea, but like when you go to a restaurant and if your crab is the same price as your fish, you know it's, it's wrong. fake. Because crab's supposed to be super expensive. Yes. What do we have next? What's that? Oh my gosh, what is that? I'm sorry. Is that caviar? What salmon, is that? Salmon roe. Those are some big balls. This is all salmon roe. Why are they so big? I don't know, but it looks like boba. It does. I like boba. I love I do rice not balls. like boba. What? Let's pop one of these and see what happens. Maybe a fish will come out. Oh, oh! Oh! Look at the juices! I've oh never done that! Oh my gosh. How big was this salmon? That thing is big, Jay. What is that thing? It looks hurt. You can like in see inside of this. Is this science? I, I can't. Yes, yeah, science! Okay, here. We should just suckle them out. Oh my gosh, this is so gross. <laughs> Would you to like me? to suckle on some of these rows? <laughs> Cheers! Oh god. Sinead, you should just suckle on one. Just pop it in your mouth. It tastes like a sardine exploded in you your guys, mouth. You guys, that popped in my mouth? I gotta say, it is like a sensory experience. Though. Whoa! <laughs> that is gross. That's not good, that's not good. You can't even pretend that that's good. No. What? It's just like salty water balls. But you know what? This <laughs> <laughs> Salty water balls. <laughs> this is the plenty of fish roll. Oh, what is this? Is this like a, a oh crunch God. roll? I love crunchy rolls, even though I'm against cooking sushi as yeah, well. Yeah, same, but this obviously is some sort of shrimp. This is a long tail. This is like one whole animal. No way. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what is in this? It's it's definitely a scrimp. <laughs> I think I see some tuna. I don't think I can look at some salmon, salmon. Roll the same way again. Oh. Even the little ones now, I'm like, if I magnified those, it'd be the ones that were just in my mouth. Okay, so we have oh, salmon, yeah. shrimp, Yeah, tempura. tuna right there, some sort of white fishy fish, salmon, shrimp. I like the ones with the tails because that has the most shrimp in it. So I always try to get that one first. Go just ahead. go for a bite, one, two, three. It's cool. good. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. So this is a mix of cooked and uncooked. But when you say tempura, it means deep fried. So mm -hmm. see how the tail is sticking out? In the middle is shrimp tempura. Right. And then on the outside is all the raw stuff with rice paper surrounding it. I only taste one kind of fish. What is it? Salmon. Like it's good, but I don't. I would not be able to say like, oh, I had five different types of fish. Uh -uh. They could have put one type of fish and it would taste the exact same, I think. Yeah, and it all gets like mixed in some sort of mixture. Uh -huh. But this is amazing. This is like definitely the ultimate roll. Look at that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Amazing. Okay guys, clear the way. Clearing. <gasps> do we get to make our own sushi? Yes you do. Oh my gosh. I've always wanted to do this. This Shanine. is so exciting. 
I think how you do it is that I don't know, but let's make it up. Okay. So this is the sushi maker thing. You take the seaweed. Okay. You lay it down. Then you put some rice in there. Oh my gosh, I've always wanted to do this! We're doing an inside out roll. I'm We're gonna separate. do our own interpretations. Cause I love going on first dates for sushi. And one time I went on a date with this guy who took me to this place where we had black rice sushi. Have you ever had that? No. Freaking amazing. It's like crunchier kind of. It's like more hearty. Mm, I kind of like crunchy rice. Me too. If I'm being honest though, sushi rice is one of my favorite because it's really sticky and I like the texture of sushi rice. Yeah, me too. Okay, okay so. Okay, now what? Oh look, there's gloves. <laughs> Whoops. You've had this pair of extra gloves this whole time. An insider told us that if you get your fingertips wet, then that helps. Oh, really? See, I have mine on there and now I'm flipping it. And literally I've never done this and I have no idea. It's kind of going well. Okay, so now, I don't know, maybe we could like line it with like some cukes. Cukies? We have the cukes. I think, you know, I, I don't know, I'm just wild guessing. I don't know, and then some avocados. I literally have no idea what I I'm have doing. no clue what I'm doing most of the time right what now. What is this? Oh yeah, that's wasabi. <laughs> that's a lot of wasabi. Oh my gosh, you guys. Is your nose burning? Woo! Woo! Hey. Woo! Woo! I feel clear. <laughs> and then just take some of that crab, just dollop it down. Is this real crab or is this crab with a K? This is crab with a K. All right. Okay, so now I think we roll her up. Justin, you're supposed to use the mat. Roll yeah. the mat. Oh, you roll the mat! <laughs> I knew that. But isn't the mat gonna be inside yeah. the sushi now? Yeah. So I think you have to do it like, you have to basically use the mat as just a guide. This is the biggest sushi <laughs> I've ever, wow. We gotta call the aquarium or something, dude. I don't think I'm doing this right. <laughs> Shame. Are you hungry? <laughs> Here. Oh. <laughs> okay, and then I like to um, add some seaweed or sea salt. What is this called? Sesame. Sesame. <laughs> This is freaking hideous. Like, who would ever eat this? I think you could sell that to someone in our office right now for a solid 25 bucks. <laughs> yeah. Now do you, I understand why this stuff is so expensive. It's hard to make. Yeah, hell, if I was had to do this all day long, I'd charge them like $400. That <laughs> <It> literally. <laughs> what? It has, your sushi roll has transformed into like a candy bar. You're not you when you're hungry. Snickers satisfies. Mine's like a freaking burrito. <laughs> Just for you, because you made such a beautiful roll, I will eat that with wasabi on it. You will? Okay, let me just get a dollop. <laughs> and then hold on. Okay, you have to eat it from the middle to really get the flavors though. Okay. But because you like wasabi, you're gonna eat yours with oh, wasabi yeah. too, just right? Oh yeah, just dollop it on there. Okay. Just do a daisy, a dollop of daisy. And then. <laughs> Here we go, Sinead, are you ready? One, okay. two, three. Holy f ah! 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 <laughs> 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 oh God! What the hell is in that stuff? <laughs> I really think I almost just died. I honestly, wow. for a minute, <laughs> forgot. We were filming anything. <laughs> I was too, I was like, was just, you're gonna die. It was just so. about survival at that point. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. You look like a football player. <laughs> Um, so we just have taken a moment to gather ourselves. I feel like I blacked out there for a second. I definitely At one did. point when you were in the trash, I, I thought you were done. I thought I we thought were I done. I thought I was too. Thought we were calling it. Apparently this episode's not over. What? What is that? Oh my gosh. That, does not, that doesn't look good. This is like one big roll. What is this? I think it's some sort of tuna. Jay, that's a tuna or no, something. Jay, look tuna. at it, it come on. Like you guys. What is what that? What the hell is this? Is that Velveeta cheese? Why is Lily hiding? It's not supposed to Try be it. in sushi. Try it, Tell me what it is. <laughs> <laughs> this is the world's biggest sushi roll. I think there's jicama, carrot. Do you want to hear it? Do you want some? Go for it. Thanks. <laughs> I don't want to hold back. <laughs> How do you eat this? Just from the middle. Okay. So stick your face right in there and go for it. How much? Oh, oh my gosh, <laughs> it ain't. I'm sorry. Cheers. Cheers, here we go. One, two, three. 
Mm. This is a lot of ginger. Hold a on. lot of ginger. I'm just gonna make another sushi roll from, from the, the giant sushi, sushi roll. roll. And seriously, like for all we know, this literally could be the best sushi roll we've had in our lives. But I mean, after that near death experience we just had, I'm a little like. I'm pretty all sure over the, the wasabi like burnt the hell out of my taste buds. Like I don't even have taste buds left anymore. I can't taste anything. I mean, I could have a bleed in my small intestine. No mm -hmm. one knows. I'm gonna die after this. <laughs> <laughs> what was your favorite thing we ate today? The edamame in the beginning. <laughs> What did we eat? I can't, I don't remember anymore. It's kind of all a blur. Just like a big giant fishy blur. I know I didn't like those Nemo's. Those little water salt balls. I'm gonna have to go with the five fish, most fish in a roll situation. Plenty of fish. Loved the plenty of fish. Loved that it was full of protein because I'm into gains, mm -hmm. you know, and like abs and things. But this is pretty damn good too, you guys. So let us know what you thought in the comment section. If you're throwing up, let us know that too. And you guys come back every single week to see us yeah. eat stuff. Bye! For even more cheat day, click to the left to see us eat Canadian foods with Adeline, or click to the right to see me get rainbow hair.